Good evening, I'm Lee Anderson. Mount Bachelor is now a home base for fire crews battling that Cedar Creek fire. Noah Chast has our report. The fire crews gathered at Mount Bachelor have a common mission outside of putting out the fire entirely, and it's to stop the fire from going east and to be as prepared as possible in case it does. Mount Bachelor is looking a little different. It's now filled with command centers, food stations, and tents for more than 600 firefighters and crew members. So all of these just went up uh, yesterday and this morning. With the Cedar Creek fire exploding to close to 87,000 acres over the weekend, Team Alaska was called in as part of a national response. We come together to help out with the national effort, and uh, when it's our turn, uh, we, we, we go where we're ordered to go. Mount Bachelor has enough space and is in the right spot to host an incident command center. And Mount Bachelor was a location that provides pretty quick access. And now even the snow parks are filled with semi trucks and the oversized machinery being used to fight the Cedar Creek fire. The fire now has 68 pieces of heavy machinery and more than 1,200 crew members, but they're still a little short. So as we need more people, um, all of the requests go through the ordering group, and so all of the orders for each and all of the positions go through that unit. And the fire has showed no signs of slowing up. So what we're looking at as far as this map goes is the red lines or the uncontained lines. Um, as you can see, it's a, it's a huge uh, footprint. Most of this center's focus, stopping the fire from moving east and fortifying the Cascades Lake Scenic Byway along the Crane Prairie Reservoir and Wikiup Reservoir. And so we're, we're counting on, 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 on prepping this and being prepared for the fire's advancement to that location. The biggest concern, the fire moving right between the two reservoirs towards the Pine and Sun River. How realistic, how possible is it that it gets there? We'll just have to see what kind of weather that we get, uh, be as prepared as we can on 46, that if we need to, um, to burn out as the fire gets closer, or, or take some other tactics that we're prepared to do so and have set ourselves up for the, the best chance of success. In Bend, Noah Chast, News Channel 21.